Hello, hi guys, Psycho Kitty here. I'm back with a game I haven't played in a while. We have Bug Snacks, and I hope you guys enjoy. Oh, back in Snacksburg. Hey, um, Frosted Peak. If I remember correctly, Frosted Peak is still locked. Yeah, that's that one. I still need to go interview her, I think. She's back there, yes. When one asks questions, one may receive answers. Ooh. Start into me. <laughs> who are you? One is called Shelda. A one who is me acts as a vessel for the will of Mother Nature. So it is. One maintains balance and purity. Okay. Why come to Snapsy? <gasps> A calling felt in the soul. Distant voices saying they need you. Free tickets won in a raffle. <laughs> okay. Um. This bird held a raffle? A raffle is a metaphor. Oh. Uh, but yes. Oh. <laughs> Thoughts on bugs now? The toxin. The mother abhors them in all their alluring forms. One feels them crawling around us, beneath us, inside us. Okay, cool. Um, why did you leave town? One cast out they, the scion of toxins. Yet, lessons unlearned, the cravings only grew. So it was one journeyed far to isolate oneself and live by example. So it was one got very, very lost. <laughs> uh, I mean, found Lisbert. She, the huntress, is gone from us. Strayed from the mother's path, chasing the healer's tainted love. Oh. Thrice were they warned. So this once you shall be warned. A doom befalls those who consume the toxin. Oh, damn. Uh, who is Mother? Mother Nature! The Mother! She, the purest light from whom all life flows. Cool. Um, Doom? Can you be more specific? A doom of toxin unending! The ground shakes! The sky splits! Look not upon it! Move not an inch! Or be swallowed by the Queen of Venom! Oh. More information about... Or oh, sorry. Okay. Um... You're a fraud, aren't you? Everyone is a fraud in a sense! Okay. Cool. Thanks for... Ever are more questions asked... No, thank Seldom you. are more answers given. One must live content with the absence of knowing. Meditate on this. Uh huh. A vessel oh. of the unknown. May answers be found in its mystery. What do they want? Um... Oh, I, I haven't am not here to spew them. gossip for that obnoxious rag you call a newspaper. Hmm. I want to hear from the smartest grump in town. Very well. If you insist, I will educate you. Start interview. Hmm. <laughs> Who are you? 
I am Flufty Frizzlebean, the world's first gastroentomologist. Uh, I'm not gonna ask <laughs> why comes to snack To food? study bug snacks, obviously. Thanks. Um, thoughts on bug snacks? You are asking for opinions instead of facts. I'm not going to discuss my feelings with you, you emotional parasite. Oh. Why did you leave town? I simply wanted to continue my work, Egabel or no, but Shelda blamed me for the disappearances. I'm no stranger to witch hunts. I vacated before the pitchforks could come out. Hmm, from Elizabeth. The truth. Huh. Elizabeth was an arrogant coward, unlike Egabel. Oh, damn. Okay. What about Egabel? Egabel truly understood my research. She was hungry to participate in it. Our work together was fruitful, even pleasant, until somebody interfered. Who interfered? Shelda. That mummified fraud stoked Elizabeth's fear <laughs> of my work, weaponizing her relationship to Egabel, scrambling her fragile emotions, and fabricating a binary choice between myself and Elizabeth. So what happened? Ultimately, Egabel chose sentiment over science. And I surmise that was the death of her. Oh, death? <laughs> okay. Um, why does a gastroenterologist exactly? In baby language, I study bug snacks and their effect on grumpuses. Cool. Um, but do you, do you know where bug snacks were until you got here? <sighs> when Elizabeth Megafig was recruiting for her cult of personality, I observed something strange about her arm. She was keeping it hidden, but she displayed early stages of snackification. That piqued my interest. Cool. Um, yeah, I'm done yes. with her. <laughs> I have the password to Agabel's personal storage box. Oh, damn. It may be of interest to you. Password? That's the key. You've wasted enough of my time now. Leave. Mm. Password. For somebody so smart, you don't know much. Um, oh, hi! Egg up all hey. up here. Hey. What? <gasps> oh, is that what, um... Hey, hey! She had over here. It was... Number five. Oh, hey, what's up? Leave me alone, Bifika. I want to be your friend. Today is the day I, Elizabeth Megafig, solved the greatest mystery of this island. I found a door near the frosted casing. What could be behind it? I wonder. <sighs> oh, wait for me, Liz! Bill, what are you doing out here? Following you. Did you want to come with me? I thought it might be fun to hunt bug snacks together. I, if that's all right with you. Better be amazing. But maybe not today. This peak isn't for beginners. I've been practicing. I got Chalo to show me the ropes, bro. Uh, <laughs> very impressive. Mm. I didn't know you were working out. I guess it's hard to see my muscles under the bug snacks. You really are changing, Bill. I'm sorry I was being so selfish. It's okay. I don't want apologies, worrying, any of it. I just want us to be together. And to see how much you're exaggerating about your dangerous work. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Think it'll be a walk in the park, huh? That's right. And I bet I can even catch more book snacks than you. Woohoo! You're on. Oh. Hmm. Hello, how's it going? What's up? Well, yeah, stumped? bro. I'm not getting any stronger. I wasn't pushing hard enough. Maybe it's the bug snacks. We went way too small, you feel me? I've been hearing rumors about this monster snack out in the forest. 
Wamba said it was so huge, no Grumpus alive could lift it. Sounds like the ultimate workout. Let's catch it, bro. Uh, wait. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Meet me in Flavor Falls. <laughs> this way, dog. Just thinking about that buff snack is getting me pumped. Scorpion keeps telling me it's okay if I can't put this reset. I feel that. What do I love him for? But he just doesn't get it. Doing this for him, the world will crush you if you let it. I've got to be strong enough to keep him safe from all that. wasn't kidding that snack is huge all right you big bug here comes the chandlo slam <laughs> 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 Okay, so I need to put it underneath it so that she can they This is fun. Come on, just go underneath it. Oh. 
actually knocked up so many. <laughs> Ooh. That was a close one, dog. That snack is on a rampage. I got an idea. I'll distract the mama. You get the drop on her. With what? Oh. I got your baby ball! Nice. No one. Thanks, bro. That bug could have killed me. It was way strong, dog. And once I eat it, I'll be just as strong. Feed. Bro. <laughs> I was hoping I'd get twice as big or something. No, I'm just the same Chandlo. And Chandlo isn't good enough. I spent my whole life climbing a mountain. And once I got to the peak, all I saw was a taller mountain. Bro. Mm -hmm. Even if I could rip out that stump. I couldn't stop an earthquake. There's always going to be something bigger than me. Stronger than me. Snorpy's always going to be in danger. Mm hmm. Very deep. Very wise words. Does she respawn? Is that an A? Hmm. Oh, he's so slow. Oh. Let's go to Snacksburg. Woo! I'm gonna donate one off, so... Me well... Me my want. We me want. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, there he is! Cutie, I'm sorry I killed your mom. Me <laughs> Brando, hi. You hey, mind your own beeswax, huh? Ooh. Bro. Bro, thanks for helping me out with the training and the stump and stuff. And sorry it was a waste of time. Oh. You're a lot stronger than me in like a metaphorical way <laughs> they don't give out trophies for inner strength though so I made you one chat oh that's cute strong I guess all I can do now is continue helping people all around the place. Hey, how's it going? I didn't want to feed her. Oh, not too bad. Actually, would you mind helping me out here? I dug up this journal out in the canyon. It's, um, a record of historical landmarks and bug snacks. I um. want to follow in the writer's footsteps. So, uh, if it's not too much trouble, would you want to go exploring with me? Oh my gosh, yes! Oh, you're too kind. The first place of note is in Flavor Falls. Meet me there whenever's good for you. <laughs> Whenever is good for you, it will automatically takes me there. Alrighty, what we're looking for is a big stone grumpus face and a bug snack called a pinkle. Let's look mm -hmm. around. Oh yeah, I know where the pinkle is. Pinkle's over here. Oh. 
haven't thought about like just crouching to get in here. Have I? I have been here. Oh my gosh. What? I just removed his jar and I could catch him. Okay. Um, the stone grumpers? No. Oh, there's a snack boat up there. This comes back in here. Oh, that's a stone grumpus. No feed. I found the stone grumpus. There would be the work of the ancient stone grumps, a civilization from over 5,000 years ago. All that's left to them is statuary and some puzzling mechanisms. Unlike the desert grumps, these folks didn't preserve their dead. In fact, the writer thinks they would sacrifice them to the bug snacks, like oh, an offering to the gods and whatnot. This means bug snacks may be a more lasting legacy than any of the stuff they built. Take care. Feed with me at Pinkle. Pinkle. Ooh. Ew. <laughs> wow, that's a good one. You might have noticed Pinkle statues scattered around here. These no. must have been an important food source to the ancient grumps. Uh, well, that's everything. I right? was hoping to find a camp of some sort, maybe a corpse or two. <laughs> oh well, there's plenty more spots to check out. Let's head back to Snacksburg for now. Kill? The training. Maybe Sprout can help. I'm sure he can show Charlie the ropes. What do you say? All righty. Now just use Sprout to lead Charlie back to my barn. Okay. Charlie likes chocolate. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I can actually move. <laughs> Charwe! Oh, who's a good boy? Charwe's a good boy. Yes, she is. Well, Sprout's a better start. boy. But I'm a long ways off from teaching them to spell out "We love you, Papa." <laughs> I, I have to cover myself in sauce every morning just to get them to pay attention to me. But that's just the way it goes. You pour every little bit of love you got into somebody and you just hope they know. Okay, cool. Hehe. <laughs> oh, cute. Okay, uh, who's next? <sighs> Another What's fine up, day bro? behind us. Cranny Nothing next? yet. I think something might be wrong with the soil. Too dry or maybe too wet. 
Either way, something needs fixing. Why don't you fetch me a big old fibrous bug snack? Like a spuddy. I got a I have a spuddy. <laughs> Nothing like a campfire. That's I got not their spuddy. Me. No. Oh? You go and feed that to Philbo. Philbo? Then hold up by the outhouse for a spell. Oh, no. When his business is done, gather up the fertilizer. Mm. Ah, uh, yes. Fertilizer. You know, uh, night soil. Waste. Spud cruds. Mm -hmm, oh, don't mm -hmm. make me get crude now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Another fine day behind. Spaddy. Oh. Mm -hmm. Awesome! Ah, another f Though, have a good one. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, okay. Uh. <laughs> Look at my tummy. Have a good one. Hi there. Go away. Here's to a hard day's work. You got your fertilizer. Ooh, that stink could raise the dead. Mm hmm. Whew. That's bound to be potent enough for my soil. Thanks, stranger. Uh, another fine excuse day behind us. You. I'm not a stranger. Darling, are you ready to help me top the charts? Triffany told me about a bug snack in the desert that only appears during the full moon. A creature in tune with the cosmos. Oh. Something that beautiful must also be significant, no? <laughs> Uh, a white ah, cheap nothing like it they're over here right how do I know if it's full moon okay I guess it's full moon There we go. Hey. That one was easier than previous ones I've had. Hey there. Sheep. Oh, I can make him spit it out. Here it comes, the ballad of a generation. Sure. Bug snacks, bugs snacks on the island in my mouth, so tasty. Well, that's all I have so far. It's a work in progress, but what do you think? Can I just hide? Oh, needs work. I knew it was a hot mess. Thank you for your honesty. Okay. I don't know why I bother. I know I don't have any real talent. My whole career was an accident. <sighs> Sorry, darling. I need to be alone for a while. Okay. <sighs> well, let's see what Befika wants. Oh no, actually, he's still sleeping. What are you looking at? You look like hey, you're scheming. Now, I got a business opportunity for you. I got a tip that Triffany found some sort of treasure map while she was digging around. They say it'll lead to a huge bug snack. Imagine what a snack that size is worth. I was thinking of taking that map off her paws. That's where you come in. Get um. me a bug snack so delicious that Triffany would die for it and we'll trade. Then we'll split the profits 50-50. Did you say 15? 
Did you say 50? I clearly said 50. Yeah. <laughs> mm hmm. Buffalocus? Have you ever seen a Buffalocus? It's this one, Buffalocus. Okay, that one is in the. Sounds, yes. Over there. I can jump up there. I have the snack Great to trade. Work now. now hand it over and watch me work. Mm. You sure? Oh, man, I am stuffed thanks to my friend here. I couldn't eat another snack. Guess I'll just throw away this delicious buffalo -cust. Did you say buffalo -cust? Oh, Hold on now, Cromdo. I'd be happy to take it. Take it? I don't do charity, Triff. Uh, what do you want for it? Well, I happen to be in a market for a treasure map. Never mind. See ya. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> What's the deal here? I'm not letting a crook like you get a hold of that map. You'll just swipe the bug snacks and sell them off. No, 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 mm -hmm. wait, 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 wait. I, 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 Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, Last hello. one. Ah, you're here. I have need of your assistance again. Since my last discovery, I've been testing the limits of bug snack regeneration. Unfortunately, I've done all I can with this one leg. I want to try something rather more advanced. Put simply, I'm going to remove my head. Oh. Um. Can Pardon again? me, I forgot your limitations. Remove as in cut off. Head, as in the thinky part, and I am reasonably certain that bug snacks will regrow it in its entirety. This seems unsafe. Indeed, perhaps I could do something more measured if I had a full team funding and a great deal more subjects. But as usual, nobody's volunteering. I can find well, more volunteers. Pretty well. You're welcome to try. <laughs> cool. Uh, scrums to help. Okay. Ah. Oh. I'm just saying, uh, maybe. Uh, your whole premise is flawed from the get-go. If bug snacks aren't like plants, then no amount of elbow grease is gonna make this work. Trippy, I thought you were here to support me. Oh, uh, I am. It, it's just, um, you keep trying this over and over, and one of these days you gotta pack it in. <sighs> so I'm on my own. Well, if that's how you choose to look at it, Dang. Um. <clears throat> we hold oh, Floofty? Well, Floofty's fun to gab with, but their methods are pretty extreme, don't you think? Okay. Uh, will you help no. Floofty? Oh. <laughs> uh. Sprout! Huh? Oh, just a bad dream. No, come here, come here. Will you help Flufty? No, no thanks. That Flufty shows up in my nightmares. Does he drink behind me? 
Okay. Aloha! Will you Done. have thrifty? They once called me a vociferous profligate. What? I'm terribly insulted, though I have no idea what that even means. Oh. Okay. Will you help Floofty? Why? Is Floofty looking for someone to snack on? LOL JK, but seriously, no. Oh. Okay. Um... Then it... Will you help? Speak not of the wicked alchemist. Oh. They who gladly hasten our doom. Cool, cool, cool. Hey, pal! Would you what, help? are you kidding me, pal? I like my organs where they are. Thank you very much. Cool, cool. Where's the stump, Snorpy? I removed it with my digging device. It took five minutes. Bro! Oh! oh. Thanks. Anytime, Chandlo. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh, he's well, not there. Help. Um. Absolutely oh, yeah. not. Oh, okay. Whatever scheme my sibling put you up to, it certainly won't end well. Cool, cool. <sighs> cool you no? Peace. She already has that. Out. Okay. <sighs> Greetings. No volunteers. As expected. My name alone is enough to frighten them off. True. Uh, does that... Bother Hardly. You? It's not me they're okay. truly afraid of. They give in to cowardice and ignorance because they cannot fathom the tremendous good that my research can do. Since I have failed time and again to change their minds, the burden rests on me to complete the work. Perhaps then they will understand its value. As for you, I require enough bug snacks to fully transform my body. Only the sweetest and most filling will be acceptable. Okay. Uh, that seems out of character. A personal request. This could be my last meal after all. <laughs> oh, damn. Do I have anything sweet? Intriguing. Let me just donate that one, that one, that one, that one, okay. <coughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Oh, neat. Spuddy. Unbelievable. Very good. You're actually being useful. I have a few more preparations to make. The experiment will begin in 24 hours. Awesome. I borrowed oh. one of my brother's patented propanati traps and made some modifications. Once the device is activated, snacks will flow into my open mouth, thus triggering my regeneration. Oh. Oh, this yes, is terrifying. I surmise that is why I am inside the device and you are not. Mm -hmm. I need you to load the funnel at the back, and then we can begin. <laughs> you put a stop <laughs> to this nonsense right now! <laughs> Snorpington, here to sabotage my career again. Sabotage? I'm trying to save your life! Nonsense. If my hypothesis is correct, I will be perfectly fine, and I will have advanced medical knowledge by a century. And if you're wrong, you'll be headless. Even after everything you've done, I still care about you, Floofty. Oh. Don't try to infect me with your cowardice. 
What you should care about is my work. That is what is truly important. You are important. Despite your rampaging ego, the world will go on with or without your experiments. I would think you at least would understand. Instead, you insist on being a selfish, spineless, slack-jawed baby. So oh. this is why nobody wants to help you. Um. It's pitiful, isn't it? <sighs> I can rearrange fibrous tissue with electrostatic waves, but I cannot convince my own brother to help me. My work should stand for itself. I shouldn't need to put so much effort into explaining myself. But it does take effort. With the others, it is simple. I can write them off as ignorant, frightened children. <sighs> but not Snoopy. I know he's not a coward or a fool, which means that the error is mine. Mm -hmm. I cannot make myself understood. So I lose patience. And I give up on understanding. And perhaps that is cowardice on my part. Oh, She had... They had a breakthrough. Nice. Okay, let's see. Neat. My experiment would have worked. That said, I have realized that I have often been harsh with you in a way that is unproductive. As an apology, here is a jar of snack specimens for your private research. That's a strati. Um. Ah. Oh, poor strati. Well, that is it for this part of Bug Snacks. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe if you want to see more. Bye!